I'll tell you what, you want to you want to talk about a challenge, you know, down the highway, GMHBA Stadium against the Cats, a, a place notoriously, not only do we not win there very often, most clubs don't win there very often. I think the Giants now have a four-game win streak over them. But aside from them, most people travel up the highway and they struggle. And we haven't played there for a long time. I think 2017 might have been the last time we went down that side of town. Um, so we're not super familiar with it, obviously, as fans, but as players especially. It's not a super familiar ground to us to be at. Um, definitely deep into enemy territory. You talk about grounds that they really have a hold, I guess, on the opposition fans, and it's certainly one of those ones. So it's going to be a massive, massive game. Um, the challenge is right there for us. Obviously, a very good side. They'd be breathing fire. I think they've lost four in a row now. Um, so they're red hot, they're ready to crack, and we need to be up for the fight. And, you know, and I think a lot of people after that Essendon game, we now have a little bit more confidence that we, we are putting in effort, we are going to give it a red hot crack again, and it's not going to be you know, these 100-point beltings that we saw two weeks in a row. And I think, it, I know we didn't win, but it did feel like a win, the fact that we were competitive and we did push a team like that and we did show glimpses and we have a potential couple of ins back in the side. And I think... Ryan Mansell being one of those is probably the most important purely because I think Mansell can have a run with role on Tom Stewart, who is arguably Geelong's most important player. And we've seen other clubs do it this year. They've shut Tom Stewart down and no Tom Stewart, no Geelong in a way. So it's going to go a long way to helping there. Uh, I think if Noel Bolts is playing back, which he surely has to at this point, he takes uh, Tom Hawkins, who hasn't had the best season, but he's always going to be dangerous. Jeremy Cameron, there's not really many that can really go toe-to-toe with him regardless. So I think he's going to probably, I'd say Broad will go to him um, and a few will swing across and do what they can. But it's going to be interesting. The matchup's going to be interesting. Um, we've been doing really well in the centre, winning a lot of clearances. Presti has been great. Um, obviously, no Shea Bolton, which really hurts. But Dusty had a great game. Hopefully, he can you know take it up a notch and continue to you know, with that form that he found against the Bombers. So, I don't know. It's 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 exciting. It's scary. It's all of the above. Um, we've got the mid-season draft tonight. I think it starts in probably, or started a minute ago. So, it'll be interesting to see who we pick up. I wouldn't expect anyone that we pick up there will play on the weekend. It's way too soon. But it'll be exciting to see who we pick up and what gaps that we fill. Um, there's been a lot of talk this week after Cozzy's performance in the VFL as well, after his eight intercept marks, I think it was after half time. So do we bring Cozzy in and play him as a backman? It's, I don't know. It, it is, it's, I think it's exciting. I don't know if it's just me, but I've got this exciting feeling about the game. Um, who knows what the result will be, but I'm excited to see what we do, how we structure up and how we, uh, and how, what kind of effort we give. So yeah, it's going to be an interesting game. Um, there's not a lot more, to probably dwell on too much, but I am excited. I think it will be a great game. It's a short, sharp preview today, obviously. Um, let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about the potential matchups, who comes into the side, who comes out, um, aside from injuries, obviously. And, um, yeah, hopefully, if you're making a trip down to Geelong, um, I will be as well. If you see me around, come say good day. There's not going to be many of us down there. I wouldn't have thought. Um, but it's going to be an interesting trip down the highway. I am very excited for it, and I can't wait. Hopefully, the review video will be... An exciting one, and whether it's a win or a loss, I'm not sure, but as long as we're talking about plenty of effort and um, you know some promising signs going forward, that's that's what we want to see. And I think we're going to be realistic about where we're at, and we might win a game or two here and there, but it's about that progression and that excitement for the you know for the future. So fingers crossed we come away with a big win. I can't wait. I hope you'll see you soon, and go Tigers.